Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So in this video I'm going to show you how to draft a pattern for a swimsuit. So all the measurements that you're going to need for this will be linked below. So to start you're going to draw a straight line down and across your page and then you're going to mark in zero on the line intersection. So from zero you're going to measure down the neck to waist measurement plus one centimeter and mark this point as one. So from one go ahead and draw out a straight line. So from one you're going to measure down the body rise measurement and then mark this point as two. So from two draw out a straight line. So going back to zero, you're going to measure down the arm's eye depth measurement and then add 1.5 centimetres and mark this point as three. So then you can go ahead and draw a straight line out. So from zero, you're going to measure down half the distance from zero to three and mark this point as four. Then like before, you're going to draw a straight line out from four. So from zero, you're going to measure down one fifth of the distance from zero to four and mark this point as five. Then from five, draw a straight line. So from zero, you're going to measure out one sixth of the next size and mark this point as six. So from six, you're going to draw a straight line, a distance of 1.5 centimeters and then mark this point as seven. So now go ahead and draw in the neck curve by joining points 0 and 7 using a curved ruler. So from 3 you're going to measure across the line drawn out half of the back width minus 4.5 centimeters and mark this point as 8. So at 8 you're going to draw a straight line up and mark this point 9 on the line intersection at 4. And then mark in 10 on the line intersection at 5. So join points 10 and 7 together to create your shoulder line. So going back to 3, you're going to measure out a quarter of the bust size minus 4 centimetres and mark this point as 11. So from 11, you're going to draw a straight line down and mark in 12 on the line intersection from 1 and then mark in 13 on the line intersection at 2. So join points 10, 9 and 11 together using a curved ruler and this is going to create your arm's eye. So going back to one, you're going to measure down a quarter of the way to two and mark this point as 14. So from 14, you're going to draw a straight line out and mark this as 15 on the line intersection out from 12. So at 15, you're going to measure in 0 0.5 centimeters and mark this point as 16. So at 12, you're going to measure in two centimeters and mark this point as 17. Using a curved ruler, you're going to join points 11, 17 and 16 to create your curved side seam. At two, you're going to measure out six centimeters and mark this point as 18. So now join points 18 and 16 together. So using a curved ruler, you're going to curve out the line from 18 to 16 by 0 0.5 centimeters. And this is going to create your back leg curve. So at two, you're going to drop the line joining two and 18 by 0 0.5 centimeters, and then draw in a new line using a curved ruler. And that is the back of the pattern finished, apart from the back neckline, which we'll be doing next. But now we can move on to the front, which is actually going to be continued over the back pattern. So from three, you're going to measure up halfway to four and mark this point as 19. So now we're going to draw in the back and the front neckline. So at the line seven to 10, you're going to need to choose the width of your swimsuit strap. So for example, five centimeters, and then mark this point on the line. So now using a curved ruler, you're going to join this point with three to create the back neckline. 
and then you're going to join the point with 19 to create the front neckline. So at two, you're going to measure 1 16th of the bust measurement plus 0 0.5 centimeters and mark this point as 20. So from 20, you're going to measure out by 3.5 centimeters and mark this point as 21. So from 21, you're going to draw a line up by two centimeters and mark this point as 22. So now join points 16 and 22 together with a straight line. So on the line 16 to 22, you're going to mark in 23 midway. Then using a ruler, you're going to need to curve that line from 16 to 22 inwards by 1.75 centimeters up from 23. So going back to two, you're going to measure down the same distance from two to 20 and mark this point as 24. So at 24, you're going to draw out a line six centimeters and mark this point as 25. So join points 21 and 25 together with a straight ruler, but then you're going to go back in with your curved driller and you're going to curve the line inwards by 0 0.3 centimeters. At 24, you're going to drop the line by 0 0.5 centimeters and then join it with 25 using a curved driller. And this is the front finished. So now you have a finished swimsuit pattern. So in the next video, I'm going to show you how to alter this pattern so that you can create a cupped or a brass swimsuit. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please hit that thumbs up button as it really helps support my channel. And don't forget to subscribe for more pattern videos. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.